Understanding Welfare Reform, a guide to English language learners. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to explore the meaning of an important but often misunderstood term, welfare reform. This concept plays a significant role in politics and social policy, and understanding it can help you better grasp current affairs and social issues. So, let's dive in. Before delving into welfare reform, it's crucial to understand what welfare means. In many countries, welfare refers to government programs designed to support individuals and families in need. These programs can include financial assistance, health care, food subsidies, and housing support. The primary goal of welfare is to ensure a basic standard of living for all citizens, especially those who face financial difficulties. Reform means making changes to something, usually a system or policy, to improve it. In the context of welfare, reform can involve changing how welfare programs are funded, who is eligible for them, and what kind of benefits are provided. These changes are often driven by different political ideologies and economic theories about the best way to support society's most vulnerable members. Now, let's combine these concepts. Welfare reform refers to changes made to the welfare system. The reasons for these reforms can vary widely, from reducing government spending and preventing abuse of the system to improving the efficiency of welfare programs and better assisting those in need. Different countries have different approaches to welfare reform, often reflecting their unique social, economic, and political contexts. To give you a clearer picture, let's look at some examples. In the United States, a significant welfare reform occurred in 1996, which included changes like introducing work requirements for welfare recipients and placing time limits on how long individuals can receive benefits. In other countries, reforms might focus on expanding health care coverage or increasing the amount of financial aid provided to low-income families. I hope this video has helped clarify the concept of welfare reform for you. Understanding such terms can enhance your grasp of English language and help you follow global discussions on social policy. Remember, language learning is not just about words and grammar, it's also about understanding the ideas and contexts behind the words. See you in our next video, and keep learning!